to our teachers, staff, and parents. My name is Mike Morath, Commissioner of the Texas Education Agency. We live in unnerving times. COVID has been a major disruption in all of our lives, both personally and professionally. I've talked to so many teachers and parents around the state of Texas who are itching to see kids back in classrooms, students who want to see their friends and their teachers, teachers who want to get back in classrooms, and I've also talked to many teachers and parents who are nervous about what this means and how, how can it be done safely. We at TEA have spent the last several months talking to medical experts around the state, around the country, as well as examining how schools are being reopened around the globe. And we've crafted a framework so that schools can open safely, subject to a variety of adjustments to keep our staff and our students safe. We know that there are parents who are nervous and who want to keep their children home. And for that, we will support them with remote instruction 100% of the way. But we also know that the on-campus instructional environment is invaluable, that a child's academic and social growth flourishes in a Texas public school. As a result, our framework ensures that there will be on-campus instruction available for all students who need it in the state of Texas. But at the same time, we know we need to provide local schools flexibility to adapt to local health conditions, especially given the rise in COVID cases that we're seeing across the state. Today, we've announced that every school that needs it can adopt a four-week back-to-school transition window where instruction can be fully virtual if need be. This should give us time to work collectively to flatten the curve on this epidemic. And at the same time, if that is insufficient time, local school boards have the ability to adopt an additional four-week transition window should that be necessary. To our Texas teachers, what you do in normal times is nothing short of extraordinary, helping eager young minds become the best versions of themselves. But these are not normal times. We will support flexibility at the local level to ensure that all of our schools remain safe and are available to our kids. Thank you to teachers and parents across the state of Texas. God bless.